Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my playthrough of Alan Wake 2. Last time, we had possibly the best episode of the game so far. Uh, nice musical of uh, everything that's transpired in Alan Wake's story from, I guess, the first and first game and this game. Um, amazing episode. Again, it, it's probably... I don't know how they're going to top it, but... Um, that's pretty much all that happened that that took about like a good 20 minutes to get through 25 minutes and i apologize if i lingered on some parts just because again it was it was beautiful to watch but we are still in the dark place and we still have bloop bloop you say we still have to settle alan's story it was all about me. This performance the Dark Place was putting on. But I had no control over it. I knew how utterly lost I was. The payphone was ringing again. The mystery caller was back at it. I had to find out more. Alan Wake? Do you know who I am? How the fuck could I? Whoa! There's that famous temper. Lucky thing I'm not a paparazzi. You keep jerking me around. Is this Thomas to Zane? You are. You remember? You... Oh, fuck me. Alan, 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 listen, listen. Uh, tell me, how much do you remember? Did you visit Parliament Tower? Did you find anything there? Yeah. Alice? is in danger. Scratch is reaching out to her and there, there's another manuscript. Not initiation, return. I saw the title page. I, I don't remember writing it. Return? Oh man, this is what we're after. The Scratch can't have it. Our, our survival, the survival of the fucking cosmic everything depends on this. Come to me. Ocean View Hotel. I left my room oh. for you. It's right there on the payphone. Remember, the dark place works in loops and rituals. If the waves keep pushing you away, you just need to find another way in. We go with the flow of this ocean. Catch you soon, brother. The Ocean View Hotel. A suspicious invitation to a shady meeting. Right on the money for the hard-boiled genre the whole city was built upon. Okay, so first off, I'm wondering... Uh, we still don't know who's on the other end of the phone. I'm wondering if it's Thomas Zane, although it's a completely different voice actor if it is. Um, and I'm wondering if it's intentional. Because in Control, when we did the... Um, the DLC for Alan Wake, Thomas Zane was basically a copy of Alan, who sounded like him. I, I think maybe his voice was a little bit different, but he basically looked and sounded pretty much like Alan. Um, and I'm, it's pretty much, I, I feel like it's kind of, obviously it's intentional, but what I mean is, it, it was established that I mean, the first game, Thomas Zane basically wrote the whole story of Alan Wake. How he came to Cauldron Lake, how his wife got captured by a dark place, yada, 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 all that shit, right? Um, that whole game was basically Thomas Zane's writing and Alan rewriting some parts to save Alice and put himself in the dark place. In the DLC, we came in contact with Thomas Zane and he was still he was trying to help us get out of the dark place. Um, I'm wondering if this is him again. But again, if it is, it's a different voice actor altogether. Uh, Ocean View Hotel. Um, that's also from Control. And I'm curious how the Dark Place has access to it. Because it seems like it's an... It's never really explained 100% in control but the Ocean View Hotel is kind of out of place and out of time 
because it it's it's kind of a gateway to different realities if that makes sense um alan awakes being one of them there was a door with like the spiral that uh that was uh that we saw and like we we saw a door like this in the apartment uh when we were going to look for alice um in the in the high rise like right up right up there so ocean view hotel unless i'm misremembering the name but i don't think i am Let's see what the map looks like what is this The Ocean View Hotel, my destination. Find Alice. What is that? A dark presence is out there. Uh, it's hunting me. Its spies are always watching. It's trying to catch me. I think it did more than once. Oh, it's stealing from me. This building was fragile, constantly under attack. There was no time to waste. The Dark Presence was only a step behind me. Nightless night. The heat of the murder was like a crown burning on his brow. We've read that before. A crown burning on his brow. We've read that before in one of the uh, manuscript pages, I guess. So, okay, am I misremembering the name Ocean View Motel? Hotel? A loop that delivered me back to the street. What did the mystery caller said? If the waves keep pushing you away, you just need to find another way in. Okay. So, is there a way around? Let's check the outside, I guess. bullets oh, what is that oh thank god no bullets I got everything but fucking bullets are you kidding me
What do you say, Mirror Peak? Follow the Mirror Peak neon sign. Where, where's Mirror Peak? Was that a save room? Peak neon sign. Is it that arrow? It is. Okay, please, you gotta give me some ammo or something, man. Zane Cult Classic? Theaters. Don't know why it's backwards though. Okay, so I'm back to this. Alleyway. Casey, you're the killer, the cult leader. It's in your eyes. No, you've got the wrong man. It's Scratch. There's no time to lose. You're going nowhere. Before it was too late. 
Can I pick up his gun, please? Six six five. Oh, thank God, some fucking bullets. Third eye. Show you the way. They're everywhere. What is that flying up there? I gotta use my flashlight, I guess. Come on, come on. I 
was under attack in the shadow. There, but not there. Sorry, I, I'm really sorry guys, I've been saying much. I'm just, again, super tense. Is that a flare? What did I just do? Climb up here. I don't think I can. Maybe it's saying to go up, go up there. No. Okay. for a little bit okay uh yeah sorry this is uh it's gotten pretty tense and i think i remember no i have not been here I just fall down there? I don't know. How do I get it? How do I get over there? How do I get over there? get that thing down there. I feel like I have to change a scene somehow and I don't even know how to do that. The plot board was empty again. I needed a new draft back at the beginning, but closer to my goal. I 
thing over here. There's an echo. This city will suck you dry if you stay here for too long. You'll end up a lost soul, haunting the streets and alleys. A faded out shadow, glimpsed by some other poor bastard on his way toward the same fate. Your broken dreams become a broken mirror, and the twisted reflection staring back at you with all the pent-up anger, regret, guilt, and shame was the monster you could never get away from. You say so. Okay. Um. Oh, what's that in this way? Yeah, I was gonna say, I heard humming earlier. I want the shotgun. I want the shotgun. To see you, Tim. <laughs> you had me going. Cozy place you got here. You know, your disappearance from Bright Falls is still the only thing that folks talk about. Well, that and Deerfest. And the Odeer Diner, I'm is sure. This where you ended up back in 2010? You know about that? I am the sheriff of Bright Falls. Or I was. Are you related to Sarah Breaker? Are you related to Sarah Breaker? She was the sheriff of Bright Falls back in 2010. Yeah, she's my cousin. Oh, cousin. I had a police sketch made of Dor based on my dreams. I sent it around and Sarah recognized the face from an old case file from the 80s. I moved out there to look into it and became sheriff after she left to join the feds. Really? You have a file on Dor? What was in the case file about Dor? Not a lot of details in it. A local man named Warland Door went missing near Cauldron Lake. Eyewitnesses claim he was struck by a bolt of lightning and just vanished. I never found any official records of a Warland Door living in town or anywhere. Another dead end. Deerfest still a thing? So Deerfest is still a thing. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's bigger than ever. You know, I got zapped here right before it was about to happen. Funny, me too. Okay, so door went missing in 1988 age has not aged longevity not human alien magic uncle frank would have known more but he's dead not his real name hidden meaning so i've seen that before we've seen that we've seen that and we've seen that You don't have anything for me, really? 
Thanks, bro. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it. guy. Oh, man. <laughs> or not. Oh, it's right there. Wonder of aid. Words of aid. Uh, increases effect duration of pink nose by one second. Increases effectiveness of trauma pads by 10%. Increases hand flares air effect by 13% in duration by one second. Um, which one do I have more of right now? I have more of the painkillers. So I will do this one. How many of these are there? So, I still don't know where I'm supposed to go. Um, so I'm supposed to follow the signs. So, over there. Okay, so I'm supposed to go down that way. Nice. Words of lamp. Stores 50 health for each second when using flashlight boost on hostile shadows. Provides ten percent chance to stun. Uh, provides ten percent chance to stun enemies on flashlight boost. Provides twenty five percent chance to regain a flashlight charge on killing an enemy. I don't think we really need that. But I got a lot of batteries. Like I got, I got six batteries, man. I could see the Ocean View Hotel. I was getting close. Yeah, but I think I fucked up by taking that light. Oh, wait. I think I took that. Oh, I see. I went over there and I came through here. And I don't know where this black light is. Or echo, rather. Nope. 
So can I find this black thing? The echo. Let's see where this takes me. The lights affected where the door led to. Nothing here either. Oh, now the tower's not there. Interesting. Okay. So I take this light too. And then I get to go down. Right. supposed to get over there. Oh, through here. Doi. see the sunrise somewhere where the sun still rises settling down buying a house fixing it up building a life finding someone it's a fool's dream it would all go bad and having let hope in it would be unbearably worse than this you can take the man out of the city but you can never take the city out of the man. So what is this area here? I could use that shotgun. Yes, please. You have found an episode of Night Springs. This is optional content unrelated to the main story. You can access an hour from the main menu. What do you mean? Wait, where's the shotgun? Caught my eye. Yeah. Nineteen dollars. But how do I? There it is. Why inventory for? Are you fucking kidding me? It really takes three slots. Is 
was low. Let's see what this optional content is. Young woman on a mission to save a missing loved one. Desperately trying to stay one step ahead of the shadowy government agents hunting her. Agents from the very same agency that took the only person she cares about. On her quest, she is guided by her mysterious alien guardian angel. Her guiding star shows her the way, as it always has. She does not know what strangeness awaits her, as she follows its unwavering light to the small town of Night Springs. Tonight's dreamlike episode, North Star. Teleplayed by Alan Wake and also by Warland Door. This is going to get strange. There's no helping it. The universe is much deeper and weirder than people know. My brother and I know. We've seen it. Oh my god, is this Jesse? We've seen you. But there are some people, an agency, that doesn't want anyone knowing more than what they see. Fucking Jesse That's Faden. Why they took my brother and have been chasing me my whole life. But I can't keep running. Oh my god, I just realized this is the DLC. Uh, it just clicked on my head because the DLC said it was Night Springs based stuff. But I thought it was like stuff you only activated like during the main menu. Fuck, I didn't want to play this now, but... Look for your brother. Well, I guess we're doing one of these. Because I don't know if there's a... Yeah, I don't think there's a way to quit. You think something here's important? What, the numbers? So 238. So, okay. We are actually playing as Jesse Faden before, I guess. To track down the government agency that took my brother. Yeah. Before she now. before the events of control. Help me find this place. Now you'll help me get him back. Right. Hello? Is anybody here? A roasting bar. This place really makes me want a coffee. But I guess that's the point. Would this also be 238? Yeah, I didn't think so. What does that say? Angles of transit, prime numbers? Oh, angles of triangle. And prime numbers. No idea. More than a sum of its parts. Uncover the mysterious and ineffable essence behind every cup of dark triangles, unique roast. Well, I mean, the dark triangle is quite obviously. Um, what the fuck are those? It's meant to signify control, like the, the board, right? I'm guessing you can't pass those guys. Well, 
welcome center. Why does an amusement park need a welcome center? Excellent question. No tape. I don't have time to sit around watching movies anyway. Oh, we'll make the time. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Okay, so this area was lit up. Let's go take a look. And Polaris is guiding us there. The gazebo? Ma'am! Here! Get inside the light! Oh, they don't like the light. You shouldn't be here. How did you even get inside? Shit. A cop. Should I lie? I... kind of let myself in. You got more than you bargained for, huh? I'm looking for someone. I'm looking for someone. My brother. Have you seen anybody? Only if you count those monsters. I'm sorry, ma'am. They've been abducting people from Night Springs, too. I'm here to get them back home. But now it's time you left. It's not safe here. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere until I find my brother. I respect that. There's a warehouse just past the park. It's locked up tight, has some fancy government security system, but the intercom is busted. I figure that's where they're keeping our missing folks. There's a, a spare pistol and flashlight on the bench. I'd feel better if you took them. Those monsters don't do well with light. And whatever you do, do not drink the coffee. Oh, I'm drinking the coffee. This should make things easier. I'm sorry, did that say 204 bullets? How many of these things are we going to fight? Jesus Christ. Staff memo, please be aware there will be some changes due to new management. Starting immediately, Coffee World will only open at night. This will allow us to draw in new customers. All staff should be pushing our brand new Dark as the Void Blend. Dark as the Void Blend. That makes more sense. On that note, tomorrow we will have a special tasting party for staff. Attendance is mandatory. Please bring your friends. Missing person, have you seen me? Jacob Flemson, age 52. Male, 5'11", 180. Last seen hiking at Night Springs National Park. On 18 September, the reporting party advised that her partner, Jacob Flemson, was last seen leaving from Night Springs National Park at approximately 11.30 a.m. Flemson was wearing a dark shirt with a rock band logo, flannel over shirt, navy jeans. If found, please contact the Night Springs Sheriff's Department. Oh, whoops. And... Dark Triangle Coffee proudly presents Night Under the Stars. The nights may be cold, but the coffee is hot. This week, Coffee World will only be open at night. Bring your family, friends, children, anyone you know for fun under the stars. Join us. Join the percolation. Yeah. Let's check out that warehouse the sheriff mentioned. Yeah. Are you still with me? Oh, it's over there. Good to hear. Tasting room. Welcome center. Yep. Okay. Yeah, just looking to see if there was any... Um, anything written in those areas more bullets I mean I won't say no but um, it's not filling me with a lot of confidence having this many bullets more and 15 batteries
and it just keeps coming. That's completely my bad. Um, her rate of fire is incredible. It's basically like how she is in control. Um, okay, you know what? I think I'm actually going to call it here for this episode. Um, I wasn't really planning on doing the DLC until after the main game, but I don't really know how to how to get out of this without finishing it and or going back to an earlier save, which I don't really want to do. Um but yeah, it it's 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 fine. We'll have a slight distraction. I, I can't imagine DLC is too long anyway. Um but yeah it, it's it's kind of nice to see Jesse as part of the Night Springs uh, thing. Um, I vaguely remember hearing that the Night Springs DLC is like, um, it's episodes of Night Spring. I think it's three episodes, if I'm not mistaken. Um, all with different people. None of none of which take, uh, none of the main characters from like the main game. It's like all different stories. So it makes sense that Jesse would be one of them. Um, pre-control, of course. Um, but yeah, we'll continue on in the next episode and uh, get back to Alan's story after that. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.